what's happening I'm here at my shop I'm gonna get this little upgrade going happy to have this 5.5 back in really good service uh, you can see that it's been leaking for a while but that is General Pump's new Series 47 TS 2021 5.6 gallon per minute at 3,500 PSI, um, I got a little hose supply upgrade, the port for it is half inch, I got a half inch by three quarter extruded elbow, um, then I have a three quarter to one inch hose barb, and I have an 80 mesh, 80 mesh banjo, with banjo that just seems like superior quality over anything else uh, i have a valve on the truck doesn't ever leak i've had other valves that have leaked in two months with this hard water that we have so yeah that's an 80 mesh one inch y strainer from banjo um, part number is ls 100-80 so I mean, if you wanted a 40, you'd do LS 100 40. But there's plenty. If you're doing this one inch upgrade, there's plenty of water going through that strainer. It goes all the way down. So no need to worry about running a 40 for flow. That's, that's absolutely plenty. But how are you going to have better flow because of the one inch setup? And that's cool. You'd think that it wouldn't be, you know, think it'd be kind of <clears throat> cut off in there, but it's not. You can see it's got a good flow. It's almost like a rounded elbow on the inside. Not really rounded, but it's not a flat space to flat space to surface to, you know. So that part number from Granger is 13Y845 or S. Don't remember, but... <sighs> Yeah, that's available overnight and these are available in store so if you want to kind of do a nice little upgrade when you do your pump it's pretty pretty good to have better flow also you want to do new belts too so i got new belts for the generator side and two for the pump side so this thing should be solid for a while on that oh yeah i got a new gas tank a while ago but maybe about two months ago. It's looking a little dirty, but that's how it goes with this stuff. It's just expensive to operate. It's something that somebody, somebody might not realize or understand when they're getting into it is they'll think they're all good. And uh, next thing you know, boom, something breaks. You fix one thing, boom, the next thing breaks. The next day it gets kind of, kind of wearing. So letting things go like that. It's kind of my bad, but I had a spare unit and I worked by myself the majority of the time, so it wasn't a big deal. Now I'm getting con like jobs that are you know requesting larger areas, and I'm gonna have to get some help in there. So just getting ready for that. Um, yeah, hope this video helps you. Um, if you don't like it, I've said it before in one of my past videos don't like how I talk or whatever it's not my problem I really hope this helps that one person that's just looking for some cool power wash thing that's all my videos are for anyways if you don't like it have a good day if you like it have a better day thanks